So let's do a little example that demonstrates some of these conditional probability concepts we've been talking about. In this problem, we are going to draw two cards from a deck of cards. So that's basically our experiment, is drawing a card from a deck. And what we are going to compute is what is the probability of drawing two black eights. So in a deck of cards, there are 52 cards. They're broken down in different colors and suits. There are red cards, there are black cards, so in a deck of a deck of cards there are eight or there are four eights, but only two of those are black eights, the other two are red eights. So we want to know and we want to compute what's the probability of drawing two black eights. So we're going to define this in terms of events, which is what we've been talking about. So let's let the event A be the event that we draw a black eight on the first draw, and event B be the event that we draw a black eight on the second draw. And I should emphasize here, one thing that's very important, is that we are doing these draws without replacements. So we start with a deck, we draw one card, and now the deck is missing a card, so there's only 51 cards, and then I draw another card. So these draws that I'm doing are without putting the cards back in the deck. So formally we say that we're doing draws from the deck without replacement, no replacement. So what do we want to compute? We want to compute the probability A and B. What's the probability of drawing a black 8 on the first draw and drawing a black 8 on the second draw? Because that is the probability we're being asked to compute here. Well, I can write that in terms of the probability of A times the conditional probability of B given A. This is the conditional probability expression that we developed in the, in the previous charts. So using this relationship right here, we can actually do this computation fairly easily. I want to compute P of A intersect B, and that's really just these two pieces, the probability of event A times the probability of event B given A. So what's the probability of event A? Well, that's 2 out of 52. Initially in my deck of 52 cards, there are two black 8s, so if I just draw one at random, I have two chances out of 52 to draw one of the black 8s. So that's a fairly straightforward one. What about P of B given A? So given that I've already drawn a black 8 on my first draw, what's the probability of drawing a black 8 on my second draw? Well, since I've already drawn one card out of the deck, I no longer have 52 cards, I just have 51. And since I've already drawn one black 8 out of the deck, there's only one remaining. So this remaining probability is just 1 over 51. I have one chance out of 51 to get a black 8 on my second draw. So now we go ahead and plug these in. The probability that we are looking for, the probability of A intersect B, which is the probability of drawing two black 8s out of a deck with no replacement, is 2 over 52 times 1 over 51, which is 1 over 1,326. So this is an example specific to drawing cards from a deck without replacement of how we can use conditional probability to compute various things of interest.